Hey, I'm Skaya of SpoonfulOfParadise.com and I'm here to talk to you about one of my favorite supplements called Activated Charcoal. Have you heard of Activated Charcoal? Most of you probably have, but you might not really know what it is or why you could use it, what you could use it for. Um, and most importantly, you might not know where it comes from. So when I'm teaching clients, I like to teach them where a food or a supplement that they're taking actually comes from, like how it fits into the scheme of life on this planet. All right. So if we actually look at what activated charcoal is, it's a form of purified carbon. And you might ask, well, what is carbon? What does that mean? Well, everything that's alive on this planet, including these trees and the grasses and the plants and animals, they're all made out of carbon. All right. That is the fundamental building block of life on this planet. Pretty cool, huh? Well, if you purify that carbon, especially through fire, you leave behind what's called charcoal, which is purified carbon, because you've burned out all the water, you've burned out all the nutrients, all of the other chemicals, and you've left behind that carbon. So what's so special about this purified form of carbon? Well, it turns out that this carbon has a huge surface area in its molecular structure, which is kind of fancy talk for meaning it can absorb a lot of stuff. So. In our case, if we eat something that's poisonous, or if our gut gets poisoned from bacteria that we might eat, you can actually take the carbon, you can take the charcoal, you can eat it, ingest it, and it will absorb all of those toxins from your belly, which means you don't have to absorb it. That's pretty cool because you can get really sick from eating you know, a lot of things on this planet, whether it's poisonous berries, poisonous leaves, um, old food that has bacteria growing in it, so activated charcoal can be used for all of those reasons to help with your gut and to help with the toxins that you might have ingested. All right, so that's what it is and what it can do for you. But where does it come from? Like how does it fit in like as a food or as a supplement, as a, as a healthy medicine from our planet, right? Well, we can actually see that in nature there are animals, like they've recorded these colobus monkeys in Africa that actually eat charcoal because they're eating leaves that have a lot of tannins in them and cyanide and things like that. And so the charcoal actually absorbs the poisons and keeps the, the monkeys healthy. So the monkeys kind of learned at some point that if they ate that while they're eating their leaves, they don't get an upset stomach and then they teach their offspring and so forth and so on. So if animals are doing it, why shouldn't we do it, right? So you don't have to buy all of your supplements at the health food store. Um, you can actually find them in nature. And so I just kind of wanted to show you where charcoal is in nature. And so I'm here in the Sierra Nevadas, the forest of the Sierra Nevadas in Northern California. And there have been forest fires here recently. And that's a healthy part of this ecosystem. Um, and so what's left behind on a lot of these trees is purified charcoal or carbon. So in my effort to show you that charcoal is a great thing that you can take. I think I'm going to take some right now. So here we go. What better source? Mmm. Yeah, that's the good stuff. And it's free. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us and I'll see you next time.